Hello, I'm Joan, and this book is called Northern Spy by Flynn Berry. It's set in the years after the Good Friday Agreement was signed in Northern Ireland, after which it seems the Irish Republican Army went underground but apparently never really went away. And it's the story of Tessa, who's a producer for the BBC in Belfast, and one day she's at work watching a news broadcast and she sees a robbery being carried out by the IRA, and unbelievably her sister Marion seems to be in the middle of it. Of course, she has to get to the heart of whether or not Marion really is involved, and she learns that Marion not only did join the group, but she's also become a double agent, uh, providing information back to MI5, who are based in Northern Ireland keeping an eye on things. The problem for Marion, though, is that she recently built a bomb for the IRA which didn't detonate when it was meant to, so she's fallen under suspicion for not being loyal enough, and now she can't see her handler from MI5, so she wants her sister Tessa to take that on for her. Tessa has a young son, she wants him to grow up in a safe island, but she's terribly conflicted, but does inexorably get drawn into this web which Marion has created. It's a book about motherhood, about living in abject terror, about personal choices and the consequences that come from them, and I thought it was wonderful.